the tension is palpable and you can understand why two high level sides about to face each other and it's anyone's guess how this is going to end up it's valencia they take on real madrid and it's coming up next on ea tv well, it's a city where football is a big part of the local culture. Welcome to the Mestalla here in Valencia. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player, Stuart Robson. And we're focusing on, technically speaking, one of the best leagues in the world. I'm talking, of course, about La Liga. It's Valencia, and they take on Real Madrid. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to. Oh, surely! I'll tell you what, that really should have been 1 0. Well, it might be early in the game, but that should have put them in front. That's a golden opportunity. Well, looking at the table, it's easy to see why Valencia fans are disgruntled. Her side flattering to deceive. Maybe that's an understatement, Stuart. Well, continue to play like they have been, and they could be playing Champions League football next season. It would certainly be a surprise, but they deserve it at the moment. position here gives it a go vigorous defending has someone to play it to of course and making sure there was no danger in the end Duro Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, Derek, this season, he's been outstanding on occasions. His goal tally is really, really good. He looks a threat whenever he gets the ball, and his movement's been excellent. I'm sure he'll add to his tally today, and they're going to have to mark him really tightly. He takes aim, and a goal to give them the lead. Well, here it is again, and the way they've been playing, that was always going to happen. They've certainly been piling on the pressure here. Well, that reaction says it all. That's such an important goal in this game. So Valencia get us moving once more and a swift reply required after the setback. And Valencia moving the ball with purpose. Amala. It's a perfect challenge. He continues his run. Can he finish? And you've just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. Short corner taken. Behind for another corner. Can they cash in? <laughs> A 
elects to go short. Cuts it back. Chance to equalise. And you've got to credit that magnificent piece of defending. Chouameni. Realising that it might be opening up on the opposite flank. And possibilities inside the box. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Well, that'll be a free kick. And he whips it in. Garcia. This is Kroos. Fran Garcia. And a strong tackle. Well, inching towards half-time, Real Madrid hold the advantage. Stuart, what strikes you about the performance so far? In position, and it's in! Real Madrid firmly in charge here. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. Well, he looks really pleased, doesn't he? His side have been really good today. So the ball rolling again, and 2 0. Pepe Lu. Aurelien Chouameni. And Bellingham. Vinicius Jr. This is Kroos. Now racing away here. Aurelien Chouameni. Might be able to produce from this position. Valverde. On to Kroos. Putting his body on the line. Amala. Pepelu. And tremendous individual skill. And there it is. We've reached the halfway mark here at the Mastaya. Well, such is the lot of an attacking player. Some days it works for you, on other days, not at all, Stuart. Well, it's not been one of his best displays, Derek, has it? He really hasn't been able to affect the game here. Unless he starts getting on the ball, they're going to struggle to get back into this one. Resume match selected. Back underway, the ball is running again, and Valencia left with a mountain to climb here in the second half. Can they respond? And beating the defender. But a good piece of tidying up. A really effective shielding under pressure. Who can he pick out? Correa. Good technique displayed. Keeping the ball moving. And defensive play to be applauded. But a big match in La Liga to savour shortly on EA TV.
It's Valencia facing Hetafe. Rudiger. Well, let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch side reporter, Jeff Shreves. He landed really awkwardly on his shoulder there and is in some discomfort. But he's a tough cookie. I think he'll stay out there. Cheers, Jeff. Guillamon. Uzkachar. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Making progress. Can he get one back? Can they open things up? And the ball is loose. Well, they can keep possession of it now. Federico Valverde. A struggle for Real Madrid to hang on to the ball. Continues his run. Well, that's how to beat your opponent. He's blocked it. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Sergi Canos. Valencia throw in coming up. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Sergi Canos. Well, they've given him too much space. Pepe Lu. Did well to win the ball back. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Real in a good position out wide. Vasquez. Now with Valverde. Real chance. Oh, goodness me, off the post. Well, I can't believe that didn't go in. So close to finishing this game off. Sergi Canos. Diakabi. Pepe Lu. Mukhtar Diakabi. Sergi Canos. Could pull one back here. Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Rodrigo. Well, very effective play in possession. And pull back. Happy to take on the shot. Closing down well. Stopped a certain goal. Needed to be more accurate from the keeper. Pulls it back. So there goes the final whistle. Real Madrid victorious and their fans are going to be happy with this. Well, fairly comfortable in the end, wasn't it? Thought they controlled the middle of the park well. Going forward, there was some really nice incisive play too. It's a good result for them. Well, as we run the rule over this man's work, positive after positive, Stuart. Well, that performance sums him up, really. You're never disappointed with what he gives you. Such a good player.